since we've been doing this. A man who's as close to my heart as you could possibly imagine. A man who comes here every year solely to raise toys for Toys for Tots, to do something, to give something back. Gunnery Sergeant R. Lee Irving. She said that her husband had stopped by Walmart and he had bought a Ken and Barbie. The Barbie and Ken. And, and, uh -oh. and the, three, the three recruiters were back in the back there and they were playing with their dolls, she said. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> and, and I'm not going to say what they were doing to Barbie. But, but anyway, Ken was down doing pushing. Oh, ho, oh, oh. <laughs> ho. So, that's as far as we can take that story, but I thought it was rather amusing. You know, I'll, I'll tell you what I like about that story is that Barbie's a patriot. <laughs> I think that's my favorite part. I think that she needs, yeah. you know, whatever she can do to serve her nation. Take care of the men in uniform. Yeah. Every guy, you know, that's the thing. Every, every, uh, every kid who had a sister who had Barbies, Every boy knows what they did. They would sneak into that room and look and see what's going on. Steal that Barbie. And G.I. Joe always had his way. 
right? Yeah, and the kid was gay, so he right. was gay. <laughs> well, we're looking at our sisters. <laughs> oh, wow. All right, so <laughs> there goes Jimmy again. Yeah, I know, isn't it? I mean, it's, uh, it must be stopped. Totally out of control. So now the uh, people want to get these dolls. By the way, we've uh, we had an these are not dolls. Ken and Barbie are dolls. Mine's a motivational figure. <laughs> So there's four of them, you know. There's made, made four different ones now. There's the PT uniform, the drill instructor green uniform, uh, the dress blue uniform, and uh, what the heck is the other one? Oh, anyway, there's four different you don't know the opera. <laughs> and you can, yeah, my manager runs a website. It's uh, arlyarmy.com. And if you wanna, yeah. if you wanna pick these up, they sell them for the same price on the website. But I sign them as you would pay for them in the store. So now, it, interestingly enough, Lee forgot the name of the PT gear, uh, motivational figure. Uh, and the, the thing, that's the one that we were just playing during the commercial break here. Uh, for those of you listening at home in your cars, in the institution, the, uh, uh, this is what happened yesterday. I'm gonna repeat the story just a little bit for those, you've already heard this, but bear with me for just a second. Yesterday while we were on the air with Ron Majors, the great uh, Chicago newscaster, who's by the way from Toppenish, Washington, near where you're from. Probably. And uh, he, uh, he said, listen, uh, I, these early Ermy dolls, he said dolls, I didn't say dolls, he said dolls, I'm sorry. He's motivational, and I said motivational figures, Ron. I can't believe you'd say doll. I'm sure you put him right I did, I put him right in his place. So the, uh, the motivational figure was, we you know, pressed the button, and the thing mentioned the, it was the, uh, the little intonation that you use in which uh, you talk about how old people make love to each other. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> that, that was live on the air. And I, I'm, st <laughs> we luckily were able to delete it from air service, as they like to say, but. We got that 10 second delay. We got, oh, we got, yeah, it's a three day delay. They'll be here on this next Wednesday. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But 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 the thing is, we get, we did get calls from people on the who are listening on the internet who hear that live because they don't delay the internet, and the uh, and they're like, hey, thanks for that. Well, see, they also we also have a dirty one that talks dirty. Well, but like that's not what's dirtier than that. No, man, that that's mild. That's mild. We have the the ex salty version. That's the one. Oh my God. Yeah. That's the rip off your head and do something nasty down your neck first. <laughs> you gotta touch your eyeballs to do something, you know. Well, because I don't know, you know, I just, I can't get that image out of my head now of old people, you know, <laughs> doing that to each other. And I, uh, it's been